Hey guys, it's J Monster Energy, and today in this video, I am going to show you how to save your SHSH files, which um, a lot of you guys need, um, especially the MC model people. Uh, you guys need to save that in order to downgrade if you want. So first of all, you're gonna have to connect your your iDevice to your computer. You guys can see here, I made my own custom dock. Pretty cool. My iPod is connected, you can see it's charging through the computer. Alright, so now I'm going to have the download links in the description. And there's going to be this program called, let's see if you guys can see it, Umbrella. Here, hold on. Yeah, Umbrella. You guys can see it there perfectly. And, um,. I'm going to show you guys how to how to use that. Alright, so we're going to want to open it. Open up the app. And it's going to say... It's going to be like this. I'm pretty sure you have to... Uh, here, it's not connected. Alright, as you guys can see here... Oh, I just showed up. Cancel sync. Oh, freaking iTunes. Alright. Okay. Back to the app. Or to the program. As you guys can see here, it says uh, iPod Touch 2G 4.0. It says, uh, I think my student number, I'm not going to show that. And then it says iPod. 4.0 and then 8A293 iPod 2G 4.0 8A293 and you could choose the location I'm sure you click Cydia Apple or local host I'm just gonna leave it normal and um, you're just gonna press save my SSH I mean S H S H. So you're gonna click that, and I'm. I think my iPod's gonna go into DFB mode. I'm not sure. All right. So down here it says uh, processing H S H S H request. S H S H response captured for iPod Touch 2G 4.0. And then it says catching S H S H file found one. SHSH files to catch and then catched one SHSH files. I am not sure if um if it this saved. Hold on, let me click display SHSHs. Yes it did save. It said the following devices can't be restored safely. iPod Touch 2G 4.08A293. Alright, so you just press OK and you're done.